Hey everyone, Chaos Giga here, and welcome back to the Cyber Sleuth Let's Play series. Uh, as you can tell, uh, things are a little bit different if you're looking at my webcam, because I don't have that big giant vice grip on my head, squeezing my head to death. Uh, I've got my new microphone all set up. Uh, I, I like it already. I mean, it really gets my voice exactly how it is, whereas the headsets and, and stuff I was using before just... They weren't clear or clean at all. This is completely raw. I don't have any filters on it at all. It just sounds exactly how I, I sound in real life. So at the microphones before, I'd have to put filters on, and even then they didn't even capture my real actual voice. So uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this, because this right here was actually a really cheap um, microphone, in my opinion. I mean, 66 bucks is pretty cheap, considering that most of them on the market are like really, really high dollar like this one. It's a condenser mic, by the way. But anyway, let's go ahead and get right back into this. I think all I have to do is turn in the quest, and then we can uh, go from there. Uh, the only thing is, I have to have my volume turned off. Uh, eventually, I'm going to have some, like, little earpieces that will go in my ears, and I'll be able to listen. But I'm going to try to do my best to see when they talk and when they don't, because <laughs> otherwise, it's going to be really, really hard uh, for me to judge when I need to read out the stuff. Okay, so saving. Already saved, come on. Ryuzuka, I can't even call you a man. No, I'm not a problem. I'm going to take a look at it. I'm going to try. The client system has been hit by the error. There's no way to go. That didn't sound good. That's Cheetos for you. Oh god. I really cannot stand this guy. I'm not picking up what you're putting down. <laughs> I'm honestly fine without it myself. Yes, exactly. The MC gets me. I guess I'd better go check on Zaxxon. Chapter 6, finally, the connected girl. So moving on to chapter 6, finally. Uh, by the way, I did Digivolve a lot of my Digimon. Um, so let's look at that while also looking at what just popped up on the Digiline, obviously. Um, friends, who the part-timer's an angel. Don't interfere, she's mine. Good luck rooting for you. Do you read manga? Let me know if you find any good ones. Uh, I don't really read manga. In real life, I actually want to read the Sword Art Online manga, but I just haven't bothered to pick it up. I purchase it and read it. Um, 
So I digivolved finally my Greymon and or Agumon into Greymon. Uh, I got Liliomon already and went back to Gatomon. We can finally go to Angelomon in the next Digivolution, so that's good. Um, but pretty much, uh, Lilamon's Lila going to be a healer until she reaches Mega. I think I'm going to go into Lilithmon with her, if I can. Uh, I'll probably go into Rosemon anyway, and then uh, Digivolve and Redigivolve and all that stuff until we get enough ability to Digivolve into Lilithmon, because I've never really used Lilithmon, but she's really OP if you get her. I uh, also would like to try to get her to go down to Lady Devimon at some point in time so we can get Maestimon. Because uh, Maestimon is OP as hell on this game. Let's save real quick because I think what we're doing now is looking around for something. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing. I'm honestly just going to go to, I think, Mary and find out where the heck else I'm supposed to go. There's some parts in this um, story that really don't make sense, but uh, we got any new cases? None. Okay, so Digilam. I'm like right at the sweet spot where we're getting ready to get ultimate levels and stuff, but... How goes spying for the demons? You are a double agent for Zaxxon, though, so don't forget to check in every now and then. Oh, yeah, that's right. I am supposed to get a Zaxxon, that's what I did say. My character did say that. Durr. Kind of lost my train of thought when I started looking at my Digimon because I was just reiterating the fact that I want to go <laughs> go for Maestimon. But she can be pretty hard. She used to be extremely hard to get because it used to be you had to get, like, um, both of them up to 100% cam and 100% on ability. And it was ridiculous. I'm so glad they made some changes on the complete edition of the games. Okay, here we go. Have you heard of a cyber sleuth? I've been hearing that term a lot around uh, Kowloon lately. I wonder what they're like. You could be a double agent. If you sell our information to the demons, you're dead meat. Really, you think so? Hugo's not here. He's busy preparing to destroy the demons. Jimmy can pretend to be on Zaxxon's side, but he soon showed his true colors. Um, okay. Okay. That reminds me, the hacker who was in front of the security wall is gone. Perfect chance to break through the security wall and head further down. Yeah, um, might be a bit of a problem because I am <laughs> I'm kind of compacted here with level one, a level one champion here, a bunch of level one, well, two level one champions and a level one ultimate level. So that's going to be kind of hard too. So let's get into this. I do this every single time. Why? Do you want to get out of here? No. Not yes. No. I want I want to attack the wall. I do that every single time though. I always hit yes. So since we got her on our side, that means we can't lose, right? Don't we hope. You missed. I 
I, I don't think the Venom Trap's gonna work. I, I like to try to poison him if I can, but... It's one of the other reasons I want to go for the, um... Lilith Bond. Her poison... Uh, her finishing move has a chance to poison. I think it's like a... 70% chance of poison? Uh, it's really high, that's all I remember. I just don't want him to get... I don't want this wall thing to get a move off, because if it does... Greymon's most likely not going to survive. Let's do a guard. So maybe he can survive this move. That was a good choice. I feel like that was a really good choice. Because <laughs> now we, we have a chance to just go ahead and knock it out and then we'll grow some levels here. These wall programs can be pretty tough at the beginning of the game. On normal or hard. Hard especially, I mean, you might as well just give up on hard. <laughs> if I've learned anything about these games is that hard is like ridiculously OP, so don't even try hard until after you like beaten the game at least once and gotten some mega levels to start it out with over again. You basically have to have your mega levels at the start on hard, so that's all there is to it. There we go. I just need some more memory ups though. The one thing I'm always needing more of. Digiline's killing me right now. You happy if I power up here, right? Okay. Weird, you don't read manga? You're losing out on half of life. She should be thinking about me. One more push and she should be mine. Cheetos. Guy needs to get a... different perspective on life. Okay, so... We made it this far. Those clothes, are you in Hoodie? I didn't think they were planning to grow the team. So she only worked for the money. Face spitting out the truth here. I'm pretty sure she's talking about Yuko, not Yuko. You guys can tell me what you think in the comments below about this. Yeah, I get the picture. You're an evil, hot-looking lady. One of those country bumpkins. Only in Japanese. I can't tell when you're not being serious. Alright, let's try acceleration. I still can't use the visualizer. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize this was somebody's territory.
Get rid of that guy. Or not. Don't want him using his Demi Dart move. That will probably end somebody. Should have used that on somebody else. I gotta admit, I'm pretty impressed with Faye. Um, just by the simple fact that... I mean, her... Her character is just... Underrated, I feel. And so they, they brought her out in this right here, to be honest. Because it used to be, it felt to me like she was just... Severely stressed out, but then you understand it's just because of her feelings for that other person. Because we get more of the story. I don't understand what you're saying, lady. Take that mask off. Geez, somebody just got it. Poor Karamon. Alright. I don't think Entmon would have gone in down gone down in one hit. Did you know that Friday the 13th only comes up to three times a year? Hmm, interesting. Actually, I think I've read that so many times and still I always forget it. Oh wow, it's still held on. Critical! This is what we really needed in the first game, was all these little side quests and stuff to help us level up as we were raising our teams. We never really had them, you just had to pick the right moment to go and, and do your thing. To level up your... Digimon, but with this story, they actually thought about when we needed to start leveling our stuff up. Thank you so much for saving me. I thought I was done for when the hacker... Oh, oh, here, have this. Happy hacker memory number five. Sweet. Ooh, friendships, nice. Why is it frowning? Don't talk to Zaxxon dogs. Leave me alone. I don't know you. Why? Don't know why Yugo is acting so big all of a sudden. Okay. Don't have to be so mean. All right. I, I need to go this way just because this is where a box is at. There's another box over here too. So let's get that one. Real quick. Memory up. Yes. Thank you so much for that. Up to 50 now. I think I need one more memory up in order to, um... Ooh, a Cedramon. And a Toyagumon. Good, damage up. Maybe we can just knock him out in one hit. That'd be great. Hmm. 
Alright, well at least I got a bunch of levels on my Digimon now. And I've actually got another memory up, so I can actually Digivolve something else probably in the future. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode right here. And we'll pick back up right here and continue on with this Zaxxon thing. I, at least we're in Chapter 6 now, that's all that matters. Till then, catch you in the next episode. Peace out, guys.